Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see me. R.I.P. John Singleton. You never have to flex when you earn every one of your Fast and Furious checks. Afro with the sideburns. Yeah, that's my signature. Addictions on the rise. Comedians check your temperature. Where's he great at? Greatness is consistent. So one trick pony. From the people who work here from the mother and he was like, Dad, the whole world is talking about cat. I'm coming for your number one spot. One of us a killer and the other one is not. One of us the villain and the other one a spot. I'm coming for your number one spot. Oh, Chris, I wish you never came to this. And you pissed rapper free for the first time, but you dissed and missed the wrong side of history in a time like this. I'm so ludicrous. Sorry, uterus. You were infant chronicles. You ain't knew that this you went from Mr. Moore. This call and your phone number will be monitored and recorded. That's some true. You need to In real life, I'm fast and furious. In real life, you fight furious. Got a fast car, but you hit the median. Another body, a body by comedian. But I got paid. Wilkins is a monster. But I got read. David say the liar big than a mother. But he say got sleep. For your number one spot. One of us a killer and the other one is not. One of us the realest and the other one is not. I'm coming for your number one spot. You heard the interview on Club KJ. I gave a all a payday. I'm still going. So who care what the haters say? Ludacris, you must be out your rabbit ass mind. Made a rap song, but you ain't found in line. Well, fat D entertainers can you shit these days? Stealing jokes I used back in BT days. Y'all seen the footage from this overweight bully talking about he wants to smoke and we will go ahead and pull it. Sorry, just a fucking pussy with twice head swarming as a nice. And he bites to hold his life. Don't want to lose your life when I'm about to roll these dice. Ah, I'm just going to come in for your number one spot. One of us a killer and the other one is not. One of us the realest and the other one a spot. I'm coming for your number one spot. One last point and I'm going to leave it alone. I've never personally been with Quincy Jones, but you, that was your girl, girl, boy, boy. Don't play with these toys. I am to be avoided at all costs. Just go ahead and swallow up that little. You know I know what I know what I know. The truth is you gotta go. You gotta go. I'm coming for your number one spot. One of us a killer and the other one is not. One of us the business and the other one. Is not. I'm coming for your number one spot. I'm coming for your number one. As I am Snake and Seek, and my father would see it and speak with himself, shall be for a deal. Never a dull moment with you. Hit him up part two. Man, boy, I tell you, man, check it, man. This is crazy, man. I'm I'm really tripping off the fact of I ain't never see the diss. You know, I watched this whole this whole Shay Shay Club Shay Shay interview. And when I watched the interview, it tripped me out because I never seen all this stuff coming from the disses. To all the things I, I interviewed, Aries Spears. I interviewed Brandon T. Jackson. I interviewed people. I I I tracked this to understand what's up with the comedy beef. I even talked with Country Wayne. I've talked to everybody trying to understand the method of the madness. I spoke to Faison the day of the interview. It's crazy. What I'm trying to understand is 
where I mean, everybody going to get money. That's for sure. Uh, Mike Epps spoke out. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot, man. This comedy world is different. I haven't really seen nobody just go in the way this comedy world is doing now, man. And it's crazy, but at the end of the day, it's content. It's crazy, but it's content. When you look at like Ludacris say he coming for the number one spot. I mean, Cat Williams said that. Cat say I'm coming for the number one spot. Luda said something in his rap. Do we got a rap comedy beef? I don't know. You know, this here is this is something different. I really don't understand a lot of times where these different things transpire from. I just know that the internet content is king and key. It's a trip to me. Will will what when where does it end? Where does it end? Because I've really never really seen this coming, you know, for as the the song. But I had to say something about it because I'm like, man, you know, it's crazy how everything just keeps trickling and trickling and trickling. I'm thinking Cat done once he run the 40 yard dash. When he ran through that that 40 yard dash, I'm like, it's over. He he done. He ain't gonna do nothing else. And you and I look over and see on break beat. This this crazy situation where Suge is on the phone. He's showing him the diss track against Luda, and it's something I never would have seen coming in years. But boy, I'm telling you, man, you gotta you gotta check this out, man. Boss talk gonna be all over it, man. I'm gonna be watching and listening and looking, trying to understand what is the what is the what what's 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 the dang next move? What's the next move, guy? What do y'all see coming next? You know what I'm saying? I've heard Corey Holcomb speak about different things about Shannon Sharp. Shannon Sharp numbers going through the roof. This is a viral interview. Nobody on the internet has done nothing like this in years. In years. Cat Williams come out of nowhere. Ain't no other, nobody on the internet done what Cat Williams has done in years. Joe Rogan is the only one that got uh, one video that's interviewed that, that, that has more views. I think it's like 54 million, but look like this is closely approaching that in days. So it took Joe Rogan years to get to that. So, I mean, kudos to Club Shay Shay. He beefing with other people who jealous of him because of the numbers he getting. I don't really know, man. Like I said, Cat Williams, man. What will Cat Williams do next? Y'all get in the comments. Do y'all agree with Cat Williams making a diss track against Ludacris? Or do y'all think that's just going a little bit too far? Or do you think it's just comedy and he's capitalizing off of it? Also, rumor allegedly that Kevin Hart is suing uh, uh, Cat Williams for defamation of character. I don't know, man. It's crazy. I ain't never seen this coming. And like I said, I always knew this comedy stuff had issues when I got into this. Certain people, and I won't say no names, but it's certain people that really, you know, uh, hey, you know, they... They get upset when you even talk about them on this thing. But at the end of the day, it's a part of it, man. Shout out to Cat Williams, man. Shout out to all them boys that's getting to it, man. Shout out to uh, Mike Epps, Cat Williams, Kevin Hart. Uh, all them boys, man, that's doing their thing, man. But I'm going to keep on tripping and looking and checking, man. Check it, man. Look in these descriptions, man. Look in the, uh, uh, the, look in the comments section. I'm sorry. Get in that comment section and tell me what you think about this. Is this something that we should uh, review all the time? Look at these different situations, point by point, case by case, just boom, 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 get into it. Let me know, man. Let me know what y'all think, man. Boss Talk 101, man, what a boss is talk. Signing off. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see.